Welcome to another edition of Question and Answer with a Criminal Defense Attorney. I am Mark Solomon, a defense attorney in Denver, Colorado, and today's question is about preliminary hearings. So before we get started, don't forget to click like if you're enjoying the video, click subscribe and the little bell so you'll be notified of future videos. Now let's get to the question. What is a preliminary hearing? Um, sometimes you hear this um, quite a bit in felony cases because all felony cases have to consider um, whether or not they're going to have a preliminary hearing. So the first question is, who is eligible for a preliminary hearing? And the answer to that is, a case is eligible for a preliminary hearing when the um, defendant is charged with something that has mandatory sentencing, or it is a class 1, 2, or 3 felony, or it is a class uh, 1 or 2 drug felony. You get a preliminary hearing. What is it? It's a hearing with sworn testimony in front of a judge to determine whether or not probable cause exists. So the next question you should be asking is, what is probable cause? And in this context, probable cause is enough evidence to support the charges, enough evidence that a specific crime was committed and that this is the person who may have caused it. It's a very low standard of proof. If the judge finds the probable cause, the case will be bound over to district court. And that just means that it's going to go to the felony level court for the case to be heard, for the pre-trial conferences, arraignments, um, status set for trial, motions, hearing, and everything else. So um, the felony level court um, in here in Colorado is called a district court, and that's where the, um, the lower level court binds the case to. So that is the question and answer for today. If you would like your own question uh, for future videos, you can put it in the comments below, email it to me, or tag me on Twitter. And as always, you have a right to remain silent. If a police officer asks you what you've done, where you've been, what you have, or what you know, you have a right to say, I don't want to talk to you. Have a good day.